Hello and welcome Pixels! 25 Games is here and today I want to show you what are collections in Blender 2.8 and compare them with groups in Blender 2.79. Please keep in mind that Blender 2.8 is still in beta and I got the build on 13th March. But let's start now! Collections and groups are pretty much the same and have a similar function. Organization of your project. In Blender 2.79 you work with groups and they can be found in the bottom bar of your work panel here. You can organize your scene by adding objects to a layer panel. Select an object and press M to call up the move to layer menu and select the wanted layer. You can easily switch between the layers by pressing on the little boxes. And you can activate multiple layers at the same time by pressing shift plus left click. However, you are limited to 20 layers at all and can't add more. In Blender 2.8 groups were removed. You can't find this function anymore here. Blender want to bring back the importance of the outliner. Now you work with collections which are a better version of groups. If you want to add a collection to your outliner, just press C when your mouse cursor is hovering the outliner. Or right click on the scene collection and press new. To add elements to a collection, just drag and drop them to the collection itself. Add as many objects, bones, lights and cameras to the collection as you wanna. Or organize your outliner with, for example, only props in one collection. There is no limit for a number of collections. You are able to lock, hide and disable in render a particular collection by pressing those buttons here. If you delete a collection with containing objects, it is not a problem. The elements will be added to the scene collection and will not be deleted. At the end I want to honor our patrons for support us and our work. Thank you very much to Simon Sineda, David Heinzel, Melina Brunner, Robert Hartl, Erich Gangl, Reinhard Bauer, Maximilian Heinle and Mr. Guermatti. Thank you so much for your support. If you want to support 25 games or this YouTube channel as well, check out our Patreon page. In the next video I will show you where to find the function Auto Merge Editing in Blender 2.8. Stay tuned! Thank you very much for watching and till the next time! Don't forget to give us a like, subscribe to our channel, support us on Patreon and subscribe to our newsletter. Cheers!